Critical Care Pharmacy Minute, where I discuss one critical care pharmacy thought in about one minute. I'm Pharmacy Joe of PharmacyJoe.com. In this episode, I'll discuss the three skill levels for pharmacists who respond to Code Blue and Rapid Response team calls. Level one I call just being a pharmacist. This is when you do regular pharmacist things like drawing up and labeling medications and calculating doses. This work is valuable to the team because it frees a nurse up to be hands-on with a patient. Level two is helping to identify and reverse the cause of the patient's deterioration. This includes listening to the bedside nurse's description of what happened prior to the emergency and reviewing a patient's medications, labs, and other clinical data to pinpoint the cause of deterioration. Level three is predicting and preparing for the pharmacotherapy needs of the patient in advance, prior to the physician ordering medications for those needs. This involves having medications available and doses calculated for a patient you predicted would need to be intubated, or a vasopressor, IV pump, and tubing ready for a patient you predicted would become hypotensive after intubation, or a dose of atropine available for a patient you predicted would become bradycardic. Preparing for these needs in advance greatly reduces the usual lag time between a physician's medication order and the implementation of that order to benefit the patient. No matter what skill level of Code Blue and Rapid Response you're at, the Hospital Pharmacy Academy has specific trainings to help you bring your emergency response skills to the next level. To learn more, go to pharmacyjoe.com academy.